Hey YouTube, Frankie here. Uh, just gonna do a quick review of Guinness Harp Lager. It is the Guinness bottle. Uh, I don't think it says Guinness on it, but it definitely has the Guinness Harp on it. And um, being a big time Guinness and Ireland fan, I uh, decided to go ahead, buy a six pack, give it a try. Why not? Um, so, a couple of uh, words first about it. It is very, very see-through. I can still see you. Kind of. Anyway, um, it's real light and at the same time, slightly darker than some Pilsners I've had. Okay? Goes down really easy. Um, leaves you with a nice, pleasant taste in the aftertaste. And um, it's not bitter. It doesn't taste like a bitter beer. Hang on. No, it tastes uh, not bitter. <laughs> it tastes, uh, it feels like it's going to be a pretty good cross for them between what you would usually find in a, just a regular pills and um, their black lager, I believe it's called, which is another invention that they've recently had. And um, I'm not a biggest, I'm not a big black lager fan. I'm not. I'm a huge Guinness fan. And when I say Guinness, I mean Guinness Extra Stout, the original porter. It is amazing. Good job, Guinness. You guys have been doing it right since, what, 1759? Hang on. Damn, I got that right. Anyway. This is another really good product from Guinness. It's not very filling. I had one yesterday with my pizza, and uh, I was perfectly happy to uh, have a Coke afterwards, after an entire pizza. I know, I'm a pig. But, um, you know... Overall, a good, well-rounded beer for those of you who think Guinness is just a little bit too strong, but at the same time, you're looking for something that's so much more as far as, um, like, a complexity of flavor on the actual tongue than, um, than like, a Bud Light. You know, I, I don't even taste American anything going down. Sam Adams on occasion, but, uh... This, this will give your taste buds a little bit of an awakening. Um, out of stars, I guess, I guess I'll go ahead and do a star system. Um, I'll go ahead and give it three. Three stars out of five. Important to note that. Um, because I think for Guinness, it could have a little bit more power to it. I think that, you know, when I drink a porter, a Guinness stout, I get an explosion of flavor. And I think that they've gone a little bit closer towards the side of just beer. You know, whether you buy Milwaukee Best Light, Bud Light, or Bush Light, it is all going to taste pretty much the same after a while, if it doesn't already. This has a little bit more body to it, but at the same time, I realize that it's not a black beer. It just doesn't have what I... I'm quite looking for in a lager from Guinness. So, good job, Guinness. Um, I'm not going to buy this too often unless, uh, unless we have another ball game out back, in which case I will be more than happy to bring a six-pack of this instead of mooching people's Bud Light. So, uh, without further ado, Guinness Harp Lager, three stars. So, have a good day, YouTubers.